Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West Channel. Another good solar igniter is just your common, average, everyday makeup mirror. It's either three or five power on this one side and then just a regular mirror on the other. This is a concave mirror and it makes an incredibly hot focal point. Let me show you on some of these leaves. I think 10, 10 ignitions is a nice round number. Let's go for that. Always wear your shades when doing solar experiments. Now this focal point is projected about eight inches out from the mirror itself. I can certainly get ignition much quicker than that. Let's try it again. I don't think I had my mirror angled up enough. See if I can get you a better angle. If I hold the magnifier over in the other hand. And there's a lot of clouds in front of that sun, but this is so powerful it doesn't really matter. Sometimes when you hit it just right, it ignites almost immediately. What is this, five? Went out, didn't it? It's easier though. I know it's not great on getting you the shot for me to hold the tender in the left hand and to operate the mirror in the right hand. I am really blocking a lot of photons in this one. Let's try to get over here and it'll have to be a little bit askew to get this to ignite because I have such a big tinder bundle.
That's better. That's a much better angle right there. What was that, about six? Some of them take right off, then others, you have to warm them for an extended period of time. It has to do with the leaves, with the angle of the focal point and the mirror and the clouds in front of the sun. All right, let's do the last one now. I think this is 10. And so I'll try to do this bigger tinder bundle and not block photons from getting to the mirror. That's a good way to end it. <sighs> All right, y'all, do me a favor. Before you leave my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and in that drop-down list, select all, and do give the video a like. I appreciate you joining me on this one. We'll catch you on the next one. dollars at Walmart. We'll catch you on the next one.